Hey, what is up guys? Gemini Jets 10 here and I am back with another Gemini Jets airport update of Austin and Zeppelin International Airport. This airport update takes place on a Saturday, right about 1 p.m. in the afternoon, so the launch dresses and pretty much that's where all my updates take place. Um, the black, uh, well the, I shouldn't say that, but the table has now been covered in black foam board and I've been working on the gates, the paint pen sort of ran out, so it does look a bit crappy in some parts, but I guess, yeah, it's coming along. So, two aircraft are leaving in this update, and I have one new model on order that should be shipping sometime tomorrow. Um, yeah, so that's pretty awesome. So, let's get right into this airport update. Again, yeah, the expansion is done, so pretty much all of the modern models are on the table and again two air, uh, two models are being retired so this is their last update so let's get into the airport update also there is two new subscriber routes in this update technically two new aircraft but you saw the last airport update which was sort of an airport update but sort of not uh yeah those two models are in there but i'll officially give them their own little thing here so let's get right into the update i just gotta grab my route list real quick so i'll be right back Okay guys, let's get into this update. So, right here we have American Airlines Airbus A319. This aircraft is going to be heading out to Oklahoma City. From there it's going to head over to Phoenix. It is boarding passengers through the one of the custom stair trucks. Also, there is a couple custom GSE in this airport update. I've still got to do most of the GSE and gates, so yeah. Right here we have American Airlines Boeing 737-800 boarding passengers through the stair truck and bus. This aircraft is preparing for New York Tri-State International Airport or AC Aviation's Airport. I'll just get these two aircraft out of the way. So right here in American Airlines Boeing MD-87. This aircraft came in from Corpus Christi uh, about an hour or so ago. It offloaded its passengers and it is now going to be... Uh, I forget what the word is. It is going to fly up to DFW with no passengers on it and we're there, it will have all of the American emblems removed, and then the aircraft will be scrapped. Sadly, this aircraft is being retired, just because American is retiring all of their MD-80s. So I figured I should take them out of the airport, because I want a modern airport. And then right here with the American Airlines Boeing MD-90. This aircraft came in from Chicago O'Hare about an hour ago. Uh, hour and a half ago, sorry. It offloaded its passengers and is now going to fly empty with no passengers up to DFW. It will have the American Airlines emblems removed and then it will be scrapped as well. So the same fate for both of these aircraft so y'all can say your goodbyes. They were great aircraft. Um, yeah, kind of sucks to see them go but the new aircraft that is coming is an American Airlines narrowbody aircraft. So yeah. Moving on to the international terminal. So, so far I have drawn up, there is 12 gates, one of them is a narrowbody gate, uh, wink wink, <laughs> for something to come in the future possibly. And uh, yeah, so starting off here, we'll start off here at gate A11. Part standing here we have a KLM Airbus A330-200, this aircraft came in early this morning at about 2am from Amsterdam Schiphol, uh, came in non-stop, it offloaded its passengers and then was tugged over here. And tonight at about 12 in the morning, so right around midnight, it will be taxied to gate A6, which is the KLM gate. And then it will board up and leave for Amsterdam this evening. So, yeah. Gate A10 is empty. Here, gate A9, we have the beautiful Air Canada Boeing 787-8 Dreamliner. This aircraft is going to be heading out to Toronto Pearson. Right here, we have an American Airlines Boeing 777-300ER. This beautiful aircraft is going to be heading out to Paris Charles de Gaulle. Right here, you have a we have a Qantas Boeing 747-400. She is going to be heading out to Sydney. This aircraft is in the Socceroo Library. That's at gate 87, I think I said. Gate A6, the KLM gate. We have the beautiful KLM Boeing 747-400 in the... KLM 2015 colors. Uh, this aircraft is going to be heading out to Amsterdam Schiphol. 
skipple, skipple. Regular review Virgin Atlantic, Boeing 747-400, this aircraft going to be heading out to London Gatwick. Right here, the British Whale Airbus A380-800, this aircraft is going to be heading out to London Heathrow, it's getting food on board. Right here, we have the Emirates Airbus A380-800 in the England 2015 Rugby Library with the Expo 2020 sticker as well which is hidden by the gate, but this aircraft is getting fuel on board and passengers for Dubai, United Arab Emirates. Right here, if it would focus, we have an Etihad, Boeing 777-300ER, getting food and passengers on board, preparing for Abu Dhabi, United Arab Emirates. Let's move down here. Ah, okay, so... This area hasn't really changed from the last update because last update I didn't really see it as an official update. I moved a couple of aircraft around. But right here we have an American Airlines Boeing 757-200 in the chrome colors. This aircraft came in from Central Utah International Airport or Gemini Gets 216's airport. That's my brother's airport if you all did not know. Uh, this aircraft came in from there about two-ish hours ago and is heart standing and at about 9 p.m. this evening so... Wow, that's a long time off, but yeah, so at about 9 p.m. this evening, this aircraft gonna be heading, going to be heading back out to see why. Right here, we have the beautiful Allegiant Boeing MD-90, or Boeing MD-83, sorry. This aircraft's getting baggage and passengers on board through the stair truck and bus, preparing for Burlington Central Carolina International Airport, or Citrus Aviation's airport. Just grab my route list. I'll look at a beautiful southwest. Right here, the first new subscriber route. We have the United Express. Let me see if I can get a view on this model here. Okay, so that's about the best I'm going to do. Right here, we have a United Express Ember Year J 145. This aircraft is boarding for. Uh, just announced the final boarding call for Central Florida International Airport or Aviation Footballers Airport. Next to that, at gate... Shit. I just realized I labeled this Terminal A and I labeled that Terminal A as well. Oh, I'm so smart. That's perfect. So, right here we have a United Boeing 737-900ER in the Eco Skies Library. This is the second new subscri subscriber out. This aircraft is going to be heading out to Bryce C. Augustine International Airport or Bryce's Aviation and Sirens Airport. Gate A3, pushing back. Yeah, I'm going to just go over here. Right here we have a Southwest Boeing 737-700 in the Triple Crown 1 library. This aircraft is going to be heading out to, I forget if it's Northern or Central, let me look at my route list. Going to be heading out to Northern Maine International Airport or Delta Flyer 24 Lions Airport. Sorry about that, man. I am kind of off today. Right here we have the beautiful Southwest Boeing 737-700 in the Canyon Blue with Southwest.com winglets. This aircraft going to be heading out is going to be heading out to Central Texas International Airport. I'm uh, going to be making a short flight down there to Gemini Jets 1975's airport. Right here we have a Delta Boeing MD-90. This aircraft is going to be heading out to um, Somerset County International Airport or Nick Linus's airport. Right here we have a Delta Boeing 737-800. This aircraft is going to be heading out to Atlanta, Hartsfield, Jackson. And right here, pulling into gate A7, we have the beautiful Delta Airbus A330. I love this model. Absolutely just love it. Uh, this aircraft is coming in from Amsterdam Schiphol. It was the competitor flight for KLM. And last but not least, we have the UPS Boeing 747-400 Freighter. This aircraft is taxiing to the cargo center. This aircraft came in from Dubai, United Arab Emirates. So we will end off here with the beautiful Delta A330. 
So I wanted to thank you guys also very much for watching. Uh, sorry this ran a bit long, but yeah, it ran a bit long, and I apologize for that. By the next time you'll see this update, I hopefully will have all of the gates done. Well, by the next time you, s but the next time you see an airport update, I will hopefully have all of the gates labeled, and American can finally move from the stands or from wherever they are. You get a permanent, 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 permanent spot at the terminal. But yeah, guys, uh, sorry if when I was messing up those subscriber routes earlier. Gonna get them right next time, promise. But yeah, guys, hope you all very much so enjoyed this airport update. I'll talk to you guys all later. Again, next airport update, there should be one new model. And yeah, I will talk to you guys all later. Goodbye.